and welcome back to my channel. Today we are making garlic cheese bread. It is garlicky, cheesy, and yummy. I have one fourth cup of warm water, and inside that I'm going to add a one teaspoon of sugar. And into this I'm going to add active dry yeast, and it is a half teaspoon. Now I'm going to stir it. Now I'm going to cover this warm water with yeast in it for 10 to 15 minutes until the size doubles. It's 1 fourth cup and it's going to be half cup. This is 1 cup of flour. In, into this I'm going to add half teaspoon of garlic powder. I'm going to add a little bit of some salt. Now I'm going to mix it. Into the flour mixture, I'll add the yeast mixture. Then I'm gonna knead it. Now I'm done kneading it and I knead it nicely. Now I'm going to cover it with a plastic wrap. Now I'm going to cover and let it to rest for 2 to 3 hours or you can let it to rest overnight. This is 2 tablespoons of butter. I melted it in the microwave. Into the 2 tablespoons of melted butter, I'll add 1 tablespoon of minced garlic cloves. And I'll also add two tablespoons of chopped cilantro. From here, I'll mix it up. Okay, now my garlic bread spread is ready. And I'll put this on the side. So now it has been three hours. And I'm gonna remove this plastic cover. And look, it has doubled in size. Now I'm just gonna move it around. Just poke it and move it around. Okay, now I'm gonna dust the mat. Okay, now I've dusted it with flour. I'm done rolling this out. What now I'm gonna do is add my butter mixture. I'm gonna add cheese because I love cheese. Oh, and just put it on one side. And now I'm going to sprinkle some red chili flakes. I'm going to sprinkle some dry parsley. And dry oregano. Now I'm going to fold it from one side. I'm going to press it down from the edges. So I can close it and the cheese will be melting and it will be so delicious. And on top of this, I'm going to uh, spread some of this uh, butter. Yeah. 
And you want to also sprinkle on the top uh, red chili flakes. Dry parsley. And dry parsley. Now I'm going to transfer this dough into the pan and I added parchment paper. I'm going to cut slightly on the top layer. So after baking, you'll cut easily. Just do it from the top. You see how I cut the top layer slightly? Now what I'm going to do is bake it at 350 Fahrenheit for 15 minutes. 15 minutes. Now it's done and it's out of the oven. Now I'm going to spread some uh, butter on the top of the bread. Mm. Now it's time for taste test. It looks so yummy. It has the red chili flakes, the parsley, and the oregano, and most of all the cheese. And it has the garlic flavor in it. Okay, let me do the taste test. Yummy, right? It's so good. You can taste the garlic, the cheese, the red chili flakes. Also the oregano and the parsley. And you should try this at home. Please like, comment, share, and don't forget to subscribe and press the bell notification for more videos like this.